Now, would you believe less than 24 hours after the previously rumored actress Anna Esposito, there are now new rumors of a different actress portraying the role of Lucia in GTA 6. It seems that the GTA community has been hard at work once again, and they may have in fact actually found the real deal this time. Before we get straight into this video today, if you're new here, please do consider subscribing as 91.0% of my viewers are currently not subscribed to the channel. You don't want to miss any of the latest and upcoming GTA 6 content, news, and rumors, so please do make sure to hit that subscribe button. So the actress in question is Manny L. Perez and as you can see just at first glance you can see that she really really does look so like Lucia. It is actually uncanny. Now comparing both Lucia and this actress side by side you can see that pretty much everything matches up. The same jaw structure, same exact eyebrows, her eyes as well, same eye color. Everything seems to be matching up the exact same. It is actually crazy how identical she does look to Lucia. Now, not only does she look exactly like Lucia, like, I mean, 100% resembling her exact same appearance, but she does sound exactly like her as well. Now, in comparison to the previous actress, Anna Esposito, it seems that the GTA community weren't as convinced with that specific actress. I think they were a little bit unsure, but it seems that now, we with this new actress in question, Manny L. Perez, it seems like everything is exactly identical. Same voice and same appearance. Before I play some clips and comparing her voice to Lucia, I just want to bring up her casting page that she does actually have. And as you can see, in terms of her appearance details, everything is lining up exactly with Lucia. Age range around 16 to 27. Ethnicity, Latina, Hispanic. Also, she is about in that sort of same height that Lucia was featured within the trailer, five foot four, pretty athletic and toned. Another check to Lucia's name, brown eyes and a brown hair as well. So it does seem pretty identical and is matching up. I'm going to let some clips run of this actress. Now, when you actually take a look at these clips, just listen to her voice and you will see exactly straight away that you'll pick up the exact same tone, cadence and voice intonation of Lucia. It is pretty, pretty close. And I, I got to say, it is pretty spot on. So when I play the clips, make sure to just listen in on that. Firstly, I'll play the interview that she did last year in 2022. I'll let that run right now. Because you played, a, you, you did a voiceover on Grand Theft Auto. Like I'm currently replaying Grand Theft Auto because I have nothing else better to do oh. in my spare time. No, so, I haven't. What? <laughs> No. <laughs> you didn't do, you know? No, I haven't, no. Well, who messed up on these questions, James? <laughs> Let me see. Okay, no, because you, you do voiceovers as well. I do voiceovers, yeah, but never. Okay, that's what it was. Yeah. That's what it was. You do. James, you, you messed me up, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she, do, she does voiceovers right there. Um, I do voiceovers for Audible and, like, commercials and stuff like that, but I haven't. Oh. As you can see, just by listening to her voice straight away, you can pick up from the trailer that she sounds exactly like Lucia one-to-one. -one. It is actually uncanny. Um, I find it interesting as well that when she is asked about any involvement in the Grand Theft Auto franchise, her, you can see her facial expression changes up straight away. She straight denies any involvement at all whatsoever. You can see that once they ask that question, her expressions change up very, very swiftly and she just denies it so quickly. So look, I would say that based off that anyways and just her voice let alone her appearance and all of that that she does sound like Lucia. Now in this next clip it is actually an audio version from a separate interview done I think in 2021 so I'll let you guys take a listen for yourself. What you're doing right now that you're on the set of. Um, what I'm doing right now it's is big but NDAs that's all I can say. I got you I got you I understand okay is it a TV show <laughs> or a movie? I can't even get into that. Oh. Action, yeah, <laughs> action comedy. Man, I wish I if uh, I could, if I, could uh, I, I would. You. But right. you know, I like making my monies, and I uh, listen, <laughs> and you know they love NDA. So uh, I totally understand. First thing I picked up on when listening to this audio clip, if you actually hear the interviewer ask what she is currently doing at the moment, you see her respond and say, "What I am doing at the moment is big." you know, NDAs. Then you'll hear the interviewer repeatedly ask her if it's a TV show or movie, and you can see her stuttering over her words saying, I can't say anything. If I would, I could. 
And based off just what I'm hearing anyways, the fact that she's stuttering over her words and not knowing what to say, and the fact that she can't say what she is currently doing, it's big as well, does seem to tick all the boxes that it is in fact GTA 6. What we're going to do next is I'm actually going to compare Lucia's voice to this actress in question. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to play Lucia's lines from the GTA 6 trailer and then compare that to this actress's voice. The only way we're going to get through this is by sticking together, being a team. What I'm doing right now, it's, it's big, but NDAs. That's all I can say. Okay. As you can see, based off those comparisons right there, it seems that the GTA community are saying that she is an exact match for the role of Lucia in GTA 6. The voice, the appearance, just everything sounds very, very uncanny. And if I were to add to that in my own personal opinion, I would say that it seems to line up much, much more so than the previous actress, Ana Esposito, who we discussed in my last video. Now, summing up all the new details, just like I did with the previous video, I would say that based off all of this the fact that she's in an interview denying any involvement within the gta franchise also in a separate interview saying that the role that she is currently doing at the moment is big there's nothing bigger than gta and especially gta 6 specifically and also the fact that she can't say anything that she's under nda also she sounds exactly like Lucia, looks like Lucia. Also, the lines from the trailer matches up with her voice as well. So, look, I would say all the dots seem to be aligning much, much more so than the previous actress. Now, of course, the most important thing to mention, especially, is that we've got to take it with a grain of salt. It's not 100% at all, not officially confirmed by Rockstar Games, but I would say just based off what I'm hearing, what I'm seeing, and also what the GTA community is saying as well, I would say it's more likely than not that that she is in fact going to be playing Lucia in GTA 6. Now I want to hear from you guys in that comment section below. What are your thoughts? I want to hear from you guys down there. I think it is definitely, definitely much more likely that this is the individual in question playing Lucia. But I want to make sure I hear from all of you guys and I'll be reading your comments as well. But other than that guys, make sure to subscribe to the channel, like, and of course, turn on those post notifications so you don't miss any upcoming GTA 6 content. But other than that guys, I am out.